Did you know you can reduce the carbon footprint of your application just by running things at different times or in different locations? That's because not all electricity is produced in the same way. Most is produced through burning fossil fuels. Some is produced using cleaner sources like wind and solar. The measure of how clean or dirty your electricity is is called the carbon intensity of electricity. And the units of measurement are grams of carbon per kilowatt hour. The global average in 2019 was about 500 grams per kilowatt hour. But depending on when and where you're consuming energy, it can range from zero grams per kilowatt hour to a couple of kilos per kilowatt hour. Location shifting means running software in a region of the world which has cleaner sources of energy. It might have more wind farms, for example. Time shifting means running your software at times when there is cleaner energy. For example, when the sun is shining, there tends to be more energy coming from solar, solar farms. If you can both time and location shift, you get the best carbon reductions overall, but that's very challenging. You can also just adjust the behavior of your application, um, not moving it through space or time, but just limiting functionality when electricity is dirty. This is called demand shaping. All of these concepts are part of a new field of computing called carbon aware computing. And to help build carbon aware applications, members of the open source working group at the Green Software Foundation have been building something called a carbon aware software development kit. This is an open source software development kit designed to simplify the process of adding carbon aware functionality to your applications. And to celebrate the 1.0 release of the software development kit, we're launching a three week long hackathon with cash prizes of tens of thousands of dollars. A competition to build the most, uh, the best, the most innovative, the most impactful carbon aware application or carbon aware feature. We're excited to see where your imagination takes us um, and to find out more information, please visit the greensoftware.foundation website. Thank you.